this class we work out one problem on symmetrical fault calculation single line diagram of a power system is shown in figure the system consists of three generators and one transformer three generators are connected to 11 kV bus bar the question is if a fault occurs at low voltage side of the transformer determine the fault MBA question number two if fault occurs at the high voltage side of the transformer determine the fault MBA that is the question step one we choose base MBA and base KV base MBA is equal to 20 base KV is equal to 33 next we have to calculate the percentage reactance of generators and the transformer percentage XG1 is equal to 20 by 15 into 30 that is equal to 40 percentage percentage XG2 is equal to 20 by 20 into 15 that is equal to 50 percentage percentage XG3 is equal to 20 by 15 into 30 that is equal to 40 percentage percentage reactance of the transformer is equal to 20 by 5 into 5 that is equal to 20 percentage next I have to calculate the base current base current is equal to base MBA 20 into 10 power 6 divided by root 3 into 33 into 10 power 3 that is equal to 349.909 amps second step I have to draw the reactance diagram these three are the generator reactants 20 percentage is the transformer reactants this is a neutral point this is a fault to point 1 this is a fault to point 2 next I have to calculate the total reactants between the neutral point and the fault to point 2 in the first lecture we have calculated the fault current in the F1 we have to calculate only the fault MBA the second in this problem we have to calculate the short circuit current therefore we have to calculate total reactance between the neutral point and the fault point F2 here the three are connected in parallel the equivalent reactance is 14.285 percentage here the 20 percentage reactance is connected in series with the 14.285 percentage reactance Therefore, the total reactance between the neutral point and the fault point is 34.285 percentage. Okay. The third step I have to calculate the short circuit current. Short circuit current IAC is equal to I in the 100 divided by percentage X. IAC is equal to full load current I. I is equal to 349.909 into 100 divided by 34.285. Therefore, short circuit current IAC is equal to 1020.589 amps. Case 1. Fault MBA is equal to base MBA into 100 divided by percentage X. If fault 1, the equivalent reactance is 14.285. Base MBA is equal to 20 into 100 divided by 14.285. That is equal to 140 MBA. Case 2, fault MBA is equal to base MBA into 100 divided by percentage X. 20 into 100 divided by 34.285. That is equal to 58.33 MBA. Low voltage side fault MBA is equal to 140 which is higher than the high voltage side fault MBA. High voltage fault MBA is 58.33 MBA. This way we have to overcome this problem. Thanks for listening.